Good afternoon, everybody. Hello. Here we are at Dodger Stadium. Yes, we are. This is our first Dodger game of the year. Yes, I am so excited. You can smell all of the fried goodness in the air. Oh yeah, the <laughs> great ballpark food. Yep. Oh, before I forget, uh, we hope you like the new intro, our new spring summer. Yes. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. Look at all the little details of the pictures. Uh -huh. You guys will like it. It's, it's, a, it's a very cute, very oh, yeah. cute. And a huge shout out to Richard. Yes. He hooked us up for the tickets to today's game. Yes. Which also include access to the stadium club. Yeah, the stadium club is it's a little eatery mm -hmm. that is on the first base side between the load section and the reserve section. You can see that little stadium club, like little restaurant looking. Yeah. Right. And not everybody has access no. to it, but today we do. Yes, our tickets include access to it. Yes, and so we have reservations, yes. and we're going to go check it out. Never oh, been yeah. there before. Out of all of these years coming to Dodger Games, babe, never been there. Yeah. Excited to see something new, but we got to make sure we save some room for a Dodger dog. Yeah, our, our seats are actually on the field level, but we're just up here to take that vantage yeah. view of the whole stadium. Look oh at that. Oh, my gosh. It's beautiful. Oh, my gosh. It's such a beautiful stadium. Blue heaven on earth. A blue heaven on earth, definitely. Oh, yeah. You ready to check it out? Let's go. We made it inside. Yeah. We opted for the all-you-can-eat buffet here. Yeah, $65. $65 per a person. person. We get your little wristbands. Yeah, so we're going to wait to be seated and check it out. So we, what you do is they seat you. They give us a drink menu. Drinks are not included with this buffet. It's just the food. Take your plate. Go get your food, which is going to go film the food right now. And then when you're ready, you can come back and they'll give you a new plate. Here's the buffet. Yeah, it's got a bunch of stuff. So we're going to look around and see what they have before we pick anything. You can see we started kind of backwards. So here's the desserts. There's pizzas. You know we got to try a pizza. And there's some other food over here. Yeah, That's who knew? It's worth the 65 bucks. Oh, you can eat buffet. Oh, you can eat buffet. Well, we're gonna try it for sure. Well, we gotta try it. And they have a whole rare dessert that you saw. So what I got first is I got their vegetable fried rice. I got some of their little cute little potatoes. Uh, beets are here. I got the apple salad. They have some like stir fried veggies and the Korean short rib. So I'm gonna see how this stuff goes. You never know, right? I'm ready. Korean shirt rib, you know I gotta try this out. Mm. The sauce is sweet. I'm really good short rib flavor. Short rib, it's, it tastes like a very good quality short rib. It has a perfect amount of fat and meat ratio. Now let's go ahead and try some of this salad. The salads here, they have um, like four different types, but we're just going to try two. Good flavor. What I like is not too bold, but sometimes the salad dressing is. This is going to match perfectly with that Korean barbecue, and I, I love my beets. So that instead of having beets like in a salad, which is cold, these are almost like stir-fried. 
Try the pepperoni buffet pizza. I got the Korean shore rib also and the adobo chicken, along with the uh, stir fried vegetables and the fried rice. A couple potatoes. Well, let's try this pizza out first. It looks good. Yeah, it looks good. And they have an oven here that makes it big. Very good pizza. Thin crust, fizzy on the carriage, just dead. Very thin, nice and crispy. Yeah, this is a great pepperoni for a ballpark. There we go. It is loud in here. Go ahead and take a look. This place is packed. Definitely lively. Yeah, and I believe it's only season ticket holders up here. I believe right? so. Yeah. This is the chicken adobo. Who knew? Chicken adobo. The chicken, nice and moist. But the taste of adobo is very slight. Very slight taste to it. But the chicken itself, juicy, flavorful. And it's a dark meat, a thigh, which is our, our favorite. Yeah, this is very good too. So okay. we're gonna we're gonna work on polishing this and get ready for round number two. Try that a Korean short rib, baby. Nicely cooked. There we go. That's good. Now that is flavorful, more than the adobo, and it's a great cut of short rib, nice and tender, with the fried rice. Perfect. Here are your Dodger dogs, and they have the regular Dodger dogs and the all beef Dodger dogs. Oh yeah, these are the all beef ones here, yep. and the regular Dodger dogs. So you know we gotta have one. Which one you get, the beef or the regular? The, I'm gonna get the beef one. And they have all, everything here. Your ketchup, your mustard, your onions. And mayonnaise for you, baby. Here's my naked dog. The only thing is that these buns are like steam. You know how they put it in that little steamer? So it's just a regular bun. And it could be warmed up a little bit more, but I'm going to go dress this thing up. And this is balsamic reduction, right? There you go, work of art right there. Thank you. Might as well try the slice, you just made it just for you, babe. It. with the balsamic reduction freshly out of the oven that guy is pro we gotta go ahead and try this out margarita pizza to its finest it is so fresh crunchy absolutely delicious this is Still, it classifies as a buffet pizza. Yeah, it does. You're a pizza guy, babe, so you should try this pizza out. You tell me. Oh, I will. That's fresh. Yeah. It is restaurant pizza quality. Yeah, I would buy this pizza in yeah. a restaurant at any time. Yeah, very fresh. It is. It's amazing. It 
this. I got my Dodger dog already, but before I try that, I'm gonna go hit this tri-tip up. What is it, like a herb crusted tri-tip? Yeah. Here it goes. It's a nice, uh, kind of medium cut. It's good. Uh, I'm not yeah, having any, I don't have any potatoes, but it would match perfectly with those potatoes, with those roasted potatoes. It's nice and flavorful. The crust, it's kind of, um, it's not overly seasoned. I would say it's like mild to medium, but definitely good flavor to it. Yeah, try tips the winner. Here is the salmon. This looks so hearty. Uh, I'm hoping it's not dry. It looks a little dry, but let's try it out and see. It's not dry at all. It's perfectly cooked. It is flaky, great salmon flavor. They do have a sauce on it. And though what's nice is the sauce doesn't disguise the flavor of the salmon. Is it like a teriyaki glaze or what is that? Sweet? The sauce is a little sweet, kind of tastes like. Like a sweet chili Thai type sauce. You know the one that put Mayfloy? So this salmon is delicious. And of course, I got my daughter dog all ready to go. Dodger dog for the win. No trip to Dodger Stadium is complete without getting a Dodger dog, especially the all beef. The way I like it with a ketchup, mustard, and relish. I know it's all you can eat Dodger Dogs, but one is good enough for me here because we're saving room for dessert. Dessert time. Dessert time. We're gonna get a chocolate one and a fruit one. I don't know what flavors. I have a little cupcakes. Um, they have some, so these are gone. I wonder how these are. Those are like chocolate and Oh yeah, get one of those, babe. Okay, good. let me get one of those. This one looks really good. This is um, some kind of bread pudding. Yeah. Try that out. I think it's right here. It's a concha fresh pudding. Concha. Alrighty. You want to try one of these, babe? Yep. Oh, so Alright. Between the both of us, we got all the desserts covered. Okay. Let's try out this cake. I'm not sure what kind of cake it is, but um, it looks good. Vanilla? I'm not getting a lot of other flavors. Is it moist? Um, medium. Okay. It's like medium moistness. A little bit of whipped cream on top. Pretty good. Um, it kind of looks like, like a pineapple upside down kind of cake, but it, there's no pineapple at all. The bread pudding. Recently we had some amazing bread pudding with the butterscotch but caramel on top. Let's try this one out. Now this one is very moist. It's got little raisins, I think, inside of it. Nice kind of a sweet glaze on top. Yeah, this is pretty good. A uh, little icing cupcake. Looks like a fun pity. My voice. Looks like fun pity. Yeah. It's fun, but nothing special about this one. Just a, a nice little fun cupcake. Now, your guess is good as mine what this is. Pudding with grapes. Yeah, it's got grapes. Try it out. It tastes like a citrus custard. A little bit of a of a tartness flavor to it. It could be it could be the grapes. I don't know. I'm not really sure what this is. Do you uh, like it? Uh, I probably wouldn't get it again. This one's okay. Let's try this one first. Some sort of like panna cotta or something like that. Like, or maybe just the cream. Really taste 
that heaviness. And that whipped cream, almost to the point of kind of yogurty, but not as strong. It's nice and fluffy. Let's try this chocolate one out. Again, sorry for, we didn't expect it to be so loud in here, or else we would have brought our mics, but we go with the flow. Here we go. Yeah. This one is more like a cake, like, like some sort of cake. This tastes kind of like a mocha. Like it tastes a little bit of the coffee in there. It's a little sweet. This would go perfect with a cup of coffee. This is good, very moist. Strawberry cup. I can say they had this one. Thank you. They had this one with the cream, and they also had one with chocolate or Nutella. Nutella. One of the two. This red is sweet. Really soft. The strawberries are a little bit tart. This cream. This cream is the same cream that's in this cup. It's um, it's good. So it was a pineapple upside down cake. My pineapple had fallen off to the side. So now it makes sense. A little bit of the pineapple, the cherry, and the, the cakey flavor. It's a pineapple upside down cake. Pretty cool, they just played the national anthem. And everyone stood up and they got dead quiet. They did, they in did. Here. Yes. I mean, silent. Yep. Yeah. So we're ready to check out of here and go to our seats, okay? Yeah, let's do it. jerseys the uh, players wear and then their bats are up here too it, so it's, all cool. it's all for sale it's all for sale uh this is one of the cool play right here no longer with the dodgers no. but joe kelly Because if you get a one Dodger dog by itself, it's like seven, eight dollars yeah. just for one Dodger dog. So, you know, for sixty-five for the variety of food plus dessert, yeah. and plus Dodger dogs. Yes. Um, it, it's only available to people of the level between one to twenty fourteen. Yeah, I'm not sure. You can look it up. You can look it up. It's on. It's on their website. Um, it's an add-on that you can do even if you're doing a single day ticket, but you have to sit on the field level in between those areas. Yeah. So. Uh, I like it. I don't know if these are the right seats. I think we're kind of over there, but the guy told us to sit here, so we're liking it. Sure, look at this video. That is going to 
wrap up our day here at Dodger Stadium. That was fun. I mean, this is a day game. And for a day game on a Wednesday, it was busy. I thought it was at least 60, 70 percent of the stadium. Oh, yeah. Right? It was yeah. hopping. I think it was yeah. hopping. Yeah. yeah. I didn't expect it to be so busy. Yes. And we have a special shout out yes. to Scott and Charlene on their 39th wedding anniversary. Yes. You're the one that does our jingle. That's right. Yeah. On all of our intros, yes. they've done all of the jingles. Yes. Uh, and their uh, information is always in the description box below. Mm -hmm. And thank you again, Richard, for those tickets. They're yes. amazing. Yeah, we yeah. love the seats. We love going into the, uh, the, 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 the stadium club. club. Stadium club. Stadium yeah. club. Yeah. And we still got our wristband. That's right. Yeah. 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 yeah, so we very much appreciate it. Thank you very much. Anything right. else, That's babe? it. That's it. And um, we're off next week. I think we're going to go. Uh, the kids are on vacation next week, so we're going to see where they're on vacation too. Yes. Hopefully yeah. we'll be able to join them. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. And the best news of all, Dodgers won. Yay! Yay! So until our next adventure, we'll catch you guys on the next one.